Very good. One thing is missing is dessert. <laughs> well, I'm the dessert, honey. <laughs> I'm the dessert. <laughs> What's up and welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Miriam, and today, today baby, we have ourselves a Valentine's Day dinner. <laughs> I'm so excited and I just can't hide it now, now. Um, I'm, I'm congested for some reason. I woke up yesterday congested. Um, guys. This should be really, really good. I've made this pork chop before, um, Asian style. I hope you guys give it a try. Um, of course, you know, broccoli is self explanatory. These potatoes, I did take a bite. I did take a bite. But um, I'm going to stop talking. Let's take it there. Let's see. Let's see if this passes the test to see whether or not you should make this for your honey on Valentine's Day. Oh man, thick cut pork chop. Ooh! Honey. Oh. Beautiful. I'm not gonna do it too close. But look at that. Oh. Here we go, here we go, here we go. It's like eating a piece of ham. It is so tender. Extremely juicy. I had it in the oven for maybe like about 22 minutes or so. At 375. It is tender. It is juicy. I guess it depends on the meat that you get as well. Oh wow, Ooh, so who's coming over? Last time I did this setup, someone said it looked so weird that I was like having a dinner for two like by myself. I mean, I get it. 
but it was just for video purposes. I'm just like, it's just for the video. So, very good. Creamy. No needed to add milk, and I didn't want to do that. That is delicious. Mmm. I didn't want to make them too salty. Delicious. I forgot to add butter. I need to add a little bit of butter. But I want you to look inside the pork chop. Can you see that? The portion that I cut into? Oh my gosh. It is so good. Honey, make this right. Yeah. <laughs> this is better than the last time I made it because last time I made it, it was dry. <laughs> I cooked it too long. But it is so juicy. It came out perfect. Seasoned salt. I couldn't ask for it to be even more perfect. It's not over salty. It has, oh my gosh, I'm having deja vu. <laughs> this scene right here, I'm having deja vu. Um, it's not overly salty. Get the hint of that ginger in there. No, I'm not a fan, if you know me, I'm not a fan of ses sesame oil. So, I only put like one drop in there. Most of the time I replace the sesame oil with seeds <clears throat> if the recipe calls for it. But this right here, I wouldn't change a thing. I wouldn't change a thing. And I do have another pork chop. Sir, so he's coming out there. It's coming over. I'm gonna eat this whole thing without a doubt. You guys, excuse the the knife and fork. Usually, I use plastic utensils, but today, today, baby, this calls for a real knife and fork. Mmm. These potatoes are good. Last time I did a romantic dinner, I made cauliflower mash. If you haven't seen that video, check that video out. It's really good. I'm so happy how it turned out. I'm so happy. Mmm, mmm. I'm sitting over here enjoying myself. Wow. I'm sorry because sometimes you're like happy how great it turned out. I just still need to know who's coming out there. Mmm, very good. One thing is missing is dessert. <laughs> well, I'm a dessert, honey. <laughs> I'm a dessert. <laughs> I just have some tropical, some kind of Tropicana fruit punch. Mm. It turned out great. Broccoli needs some butter. Potatoes turned out great. I'd make this tomorrow. Let's add it up. Let me show you guys. I'd make it tomorrow. 
It's almost like eating a piece of ham. Not quite. Mmm. That is delicious. And the sauce, there will be enough for, for two, for two pork chops. We just want it as a glaze. You don't want it to be like gravy. <laughs> you know, as much as I love gravy. I just want a glaze. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Delicious. I can't deny it. I can't deny it. I have on a. I just can't really see. I have on a red dress. I have a red dress and some flowers. But these flowers here because a girlfriend of mine <clears throat> sent me some flowers for condolences. So um, I am going to cut it here though. <laughs> I'm going to cut it here. Enjoyable. Please give it a try. Must try. I love you guys. And if you are new to the channel, baby. Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much. For being a part of the fam as always i greatly appreciate it i love you guys so much god bless you and i'll see you all in my next video peace